everyone welcome back to another divine honesty this is your girl tiara and i'm here with some honest and truth okay take what resonates and today we're talking to my mountains my stable my don't push me to the edge <laughs> hey, <Ryan. laughs> we're here with the <laughs> don't push me because i'm close to the edge i'm not trying yeah, to lose my head. Well, what, what, what? <laughs> Basically, don't test me or you will get a testament, okay? You will be able to tell everybody what the fuck happened because it will be unbelievable. So, you know, let's not fuck with a Taurus, honey, because you can't move them. There are mountains in this bitch. They're the earth sign, okay? <laughs> they're ruled by the moon in this bitch. Well, not, I mean, they're ruled by Venus in here, okay? So, shout out to my Tauruses. Let's go ahead and get into your energy. First, we're going to tap into your ancestors, your higher power, your tomorrow self, okay? And we're going to get some energy for you that's surrounding you. This is timeless readings, okay? So, what is the energy for a Taurus? What is the energy for a Taurus? What is the energy for a Taurus, okay? We got priestess. A lot of y'all have priestess in this motherfucker. I'm not even surprised. How are you being called to step up and lead? You have golden wings. Look at your hand. A lot of y'all have powers in your hand. I don't know if you are healers or um, you work do Reiki. Some of you can be tarot readers or some of you can deal with the hospital or just healing people around you. A lot of people come to you subconsciously for healing or consciously because look, you are Anna, the grandmother of Jesus. Who ever knew about fucking Anna? You see how these people are praying to you, even people in fucking Egypt. You're interdimensional, okay? Seed in the light, lay on foundations. This is the divine plan. Whatever you're going through right now, this is a divine plan, okay? You're supposed to go through this shit. No matter how much it, 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 it hurts to see that part, you're, this was supposed to happen. You know why? Because it happened. <laughs> Sometimes as simple as that. So let's get this energy. Let's get your energy, okay? What's around our Taurus, okay? What's around our Taurus? What's around our Taurus? What's around our Taurus? Okay, so we have death. You can be dealing with a Scorpio. You don't have to be. And I'm seeing you transforming. Sometimes some of y'all walking out of people's life. Look, the five of fucking pentacles. I, everybody got the five of pentacles. What's going on? It's cold. Someone get, look, five of swords. Taurus, not you. Damn, I thought we were going to have a good ass reading with the Anna Grandmama of Jesus on here. Damn, yeah, and these are the two motherfuckers too. Look, you left them out in the cold. You got tired of arguing with this person. I'm saying you're transforming. A lot of you, you these people are making you change. Like, you're becoming cold. Ooh, who is making you cold? Why are you becoming cold? I mean, a lot of you either, you know, stepping out. A lot of you are just taking back your energy, becoming stuck. Because these people are making you cold. They always had their hands out or they always arguing about some bullshit. Let's see what's going on. Why is the depth energy here? Two of Cups could be a friend, yeah. It's like they you wish you never went back to these motherfuckers. For some of you, and you feel like you want a reconciliation, okay? Or you feel like they do. Could have told you something. Why is the Five of Pentacles here? Look, Ten of Pentacles, yeah, you felt like you really spent time, money, and abundance with these people. And then you cut their ass off. It's like you had to because they they were take, 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 take. Why, why is the Five of Swords here? Yep, the 10 of, I don't know if y'all was arguing about relationships, past relationships, a household, children. But I'm saying there was a lot of arguments about family life. Ooh, I'm saying this person want their family back. Oh, Taurus, this person want their family back. And if it's not a, 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 a significant other, it's a friend or family member. They want their family back. Wow. Let's go ahead, or this can be you. You want your family back. Let's go ahead and take their look at take a look at their energy. Wow. Wow, Taurus. They want their family back. Okay. What is who is this person energy? What is this person's energy? Wow, look, Page of Swords, a lot of them are definitely asking about you. They could be stalking your social media or just wondering, dreaming about you, just wondering what the hell you got going on, honey. I said they want their family back. Look, the magicians, they're trying to think of ways 
to <laughs> come into your life again. Um, maybe, you know, thinking maybe that you would need them for something or they, yeah, they're, you know, these people can also be very manipulative too. They're very manipulative. Could be a Leo you're dealing with. I'm also seeing a course, a Aquarius or Gemini. It can also be a Cancer. Um, but yeah, with this energy, Taurus, I'm seeing that they, you light up their world. They were very happy. You see truth. You saw how manipulative that person was and how sneaky they was. They can definitely be a Scorpio too. But I'm saying you you felt how sneaky they was. Like they were very sneaky. And you were always up front and always had to, you know, confront them on some shit. Even to the down to the smallest things. And it's like everything they try to do. It always came to the light. I'm seeing a lot of times they always had an issue with you as well about some dumb shit. They always had an issue with you, okay? And you know when Taurus vibrates so high that the universe has no choice but to deliver your desires, okay? You got to, you need to stop this habit of doubting yourself when you know damn well that you're a whole badass goddess or god, a whole queen or king in the flesh, who tackles every obstacle that life throws your way with strength and integrity. You deserve to give yourself an abundance of credit, okay? Don't forget where you came from, okay? Don't forget where you came from. Let's go ahead and get some more of their energy. Why is Taurus here? Why is the Page of Swords here? It's the Page of Wands. Can be definitely dealing with a kid energy or someone who's very immature, very impulsive. Or they found you very impulsive. This person could be very impulsive, where you kind of more was the person who was um, smart about your decisions. This person didn't really think. They're very impulsive, um, very um, reactive to certain situations, and you felt like they were very manipulative. Let's go ahead. Why the magician here? Yeah, four of wands could have to do with a family, family issues. They were very manipulative when it came to either their kids or family situations or different relationships, okay? And why is the sun here? Yeah, the judgment. Yeah, the shit came out. And you told them how I feel. A lot of them came and told you, or you felt like they told. Look at all these women or people around them. A lot, they, a lot of these were cheater or things came out. People came to you, okay? Dang. Let me see the outcome of this energy. What is the outcome of this energy? What is the outcome of, of this Taurus and this person? Let's see. What is the outcome? Patiently waiting. This person is waiting. Let's see. What is the outcome? Oh, pinnacle, pinnacles, pinnacles. I'm seeing some of y'all definitely dealing with the earth sign towards Virgo Capricorn. You don't have to be. Look, look, look. Oh, all pinnacles. So I'm seeing focusing in on yourself. A lot of you, if you're dealing with investments, great. I'm seeing abundance. Some of y'all could be getting married right now and are waiting on this person to grow the fuck up marriage. I'm seeing a lot of you are getting into your bag, honey. Studying, going to school, hobby, um, Picking up extra shifts, trying to be a manager. That is definitely in your alignment right now. I'm seeing that a lot of you are focusing on getting a house, or focusing on having your apartment right, focusing on doing things that better your future. And I'm seeing a lot of you are planting seeds. And this can be seeds of ideas on how to get money or seeds of idea how to be abundance. And I'm saying that's the energy you're focusing on right now. Ooh, go ahead, my Tauruses, honey, my mountains, okay? My Venuses. All right. And now we're going to get into the future love coming to you. What is the future love coming to you? Let's see. We have let your friends help you. Ask for and accept support from others. It's okay to ask for help or other perspectives. Use a discernment because some people don't want your, you know, <laughs> they don't want you to align to your highest power because they're not there. And sometimes it's not even done consciously. It can be subconscious. So you your discernment on who you actually um, give your situations to, to try to get the most authentic response, okay? Then you have soulmate. Yes, this is your soulmate. So some of y'all are definitely going to be um, coming in contact with your soulmate or it's going to feel like a soulmate. Codependency. Additions are affecting your romantic life. So be sure that you are not addicted to work. You're not addicted to certain ways of thinking to um, prevent you from coming into full abundance of a partner or a situation, okay? And your soul knows when something is real and authentic and true. No matter what anyone else try to say or persuade, persuade you of, the truth will always feel different. You can't fake it. What your heart knows, 
when your heart knows when something resonates. Trust those feelings, okay? Trust those feelings. And thank you, Capricorn. Not Capricorn. Dang, some of y'all doing with a Capricorn. But thank you, Taurus. If this really resonates, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you. This has been another Divine Honesty.